toes till I get up Time is barely on our side I don't wanna waste what's left The storms we chase are leading us And love is all we love. Hey guys, so today I'm here to review a new brush set that I got from eBay and I've just got my eye makeup done, I've got nothing else done so I'm going to use these brushes today in the tutorial so just a quick overview of these brushes, these brushes are the dupes for the Artiste brushes that you've been seeing on Instagram and stuff and I did show one of these brushes in my last eBay video and um, I found the complete set on eBay so I decided to get the whole set so I can try it and test it out for you guys to see what it is, it is a 10 piece set I did watch a couple of videos on this on YouTube and everyone that showed their brushes um, showed that it came in a big white like a package thing so, and each brush was in its individual place and that's how I thought mine was going to come and it ended up coming in this. So that's how it came and a few of the bristles did um, kind of go out of shape but once you wash it it's kind of okay. I did purchase these for roughly $30 Australian um, so each brush is individually wrapped so as you can see there's no numbering system there's nothing on them this is how they look this is the biggest brush I think there is in the set that's how big it is this is the second biggest this is the third one so this is the fourth one this is number five number six there are no numbers I'm just going in any order. Number seven. This is number eight. This is number nine. It's like that. And this is number ten. These two are similar. This one's flat. So this one's flat when it's here. And then this one's got a bit of a like a tip to it. It's like an angled tip. So I'm just going to be using my normal foundation routine foundation. I've already got primer on. I am going to take the biggest brush that I have and give that a mix. I feel like this is going to soak up so much product. Okay. We always say bismillah. Never trust, yeah. No, I don't want to waste what's left. And I forehead this brush is going to be way too big so I'm going to use the smaller one this is the third size these are a bit flimsy like this bends back so don't apply too much pressure because you might break it this is my LA girl um, Romac Gazilla I think that's just so good People say this is like the MAC one, but I don't, it's probably similar to it, but I don't think it's exactly the same, like MAC is so much thicker in consistency, it doesn't crease up, whereas this one tends to crease up. This is like the third biggest brush, so I'm going to try this. from under my eye away so you definitely need another brush for your under eyes Ooh, this is awesome I hate that the sun is coming right now I'm gonna use the LA Girl and this is like so pigmented that was too much I can tell you that was too much this is the fourth biggest size and I should have used this 
brush, which is the fourth biggest brush for highlighting. It would have been so good, like right under that eye area. Melodies we haven't played. No, I don't want no rest. Echoing around these walls, fighting to create a song. I don't want to miss a beat. For the more um, precise areas, like right under the eye, I'm going to use like that flat circle brush. We'll go. brush again seriously these brushes need names like come on it's not that hard to print a name just this Australis palette in that middle shade because that's my bay not a lot Ooh, okay. through the sun rays and on and on we'll go through the wastelands through the okay so for the blush I'm going to be using the Australis Contour Kit in the medium complexion. Just this brown tone right here. This is the second biggest brush. And on and on we'll go. I feel that this isn't working as much. It's not blending. I think this is more for creams and it's not that good for powders. So to highlight, I'm going to be using the Too Faced Candlelight Glow. I'm going to be taking just this small one. already so I used that so um, I didn't actually use these but you could use these if you've just got a cream contour or palette or something you can use this to kind of outline you know like carve out where your lines are gonna be this brush set is really good but I would say that it's more for um, cream contouring kits like it's not made for powdery stuff I felt that it didn't quite blend properly when it came to the powdery stuff and I'm pretty sure that if I was to go up close, um, you know, look in the mirror and stuff, i probably got a lot of powder on my face right now. Like, these brushes were $30 for a set of 10. If you do want to try out these before you buy the Artiste brushes, then definitely these are worth it. Um, you know, because the Artiste, the Artiste brushes retail for around the $500 mark. I think that's for the complete set. So definitely these brushes are worth it. They're so amazing, they're so great. So definitely give them a shot if you are looking to buy the Artiste brushes. The only downside to this is um, that they don't have names, they don't have numbers. So if you're trying to explain something to someone else, or if you're trying to tell people what you use, it's really, really hard to describe what you've used if they don't know the numbers, or if, that, if there's no names. So that's probably, that's probably my only downside, you guys. This is the tutorial complete in person. It actually looks so amazing. On camera, not so amazing. Okay, you guys, so that is the end of the... Okay, you guys, so that is the end of this review tutorial. If you like it, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you like the content, please subscribe down below. Um, stay tuned for, the, for my next videos. Um, if you have any requests, please put them down below so I can read them. And, you know, just show me some love. 
write a nice comment because you know this video does take forever to film and to upload especially when you have a baby so nice comments are highly appreciated just saying i hope you guys um had an awesome time watching this video and i hope to see you guys next time see you later